Italy is esteemed throughout the world for its proven excellence in many walks of life. One of its prime assets is certainly the enogastronomic sector, with its extraordinary traditions, pampered by the mild, favourable climate that is generated by its position at the very heart of the Mediterranean. It is from this very sea that Venice emerges, a lagoon city unique to this world and focal point of the Italian Northeast, whose illustrious history grew from the relationship between the sea and the vital hinterland. For its charm, art, architecture and culture, Venice has for centuries held an almost irresistible allure on a worldwide level. Fanning out from Venice in all directions are fertile plains and green hills that form a backdrop against the Eastern Alps. In each of these very different environments, grape growing and the culture of wine has been carried forward from time immemorial giving rise to products that are as infinitely diverse as they are blessed with immense quality. It is not by chance that the first Italian school of enology was founded in 1876 at the very heart of the Italian Northeast in Conigliano Veneto. And today it is still a primary reference point for national enology. It has top-level scientific, technical and experimental laboratories, as well as a winery for the production and sale of a well-respected range of wines and other distilled products. Thanks to the commitment and foresight of many operators in this sector, a hospitality philosophy is being created, which manifests itself in a new form of tourism that is closely linked to the environment, culture and traditional tastes, and is attracting an ever-increasing number of eno-tourists from the four corners of the earth. The hilltop areas of the upper reaches of the province of Treviso, other than being extraordinarily agreeable from the aesthetical point of view, have shown themselves to be ideal for the diffusion of vineyards nurturing fine white grapes, and in particular the Glera grape variety, which is the base for the production of the noble wine Prosecco that is becoming increasingly appreciated throughout the world, whether it be still, semi-sparkling or sparkling. Prosecco is not just native to this part of Veneto. However, Prosecco Superiore DOCG refers to a precise area that stretches from Vittorio Veneto through Conliano, Susigana to Valdobbiadene. The 
Typology varies according to the terrain, which consists mostly of clay-laden moranic earth. The exposure of the parallel hill faces east to west between 50 and 500 meters above sea level. The microclimate created by the vicinity and protection of the mountains and a marked temperature excursion are some of the positive and decisive factors for these vineyards, located in a beautiful area but extremely difficult to cultivate. Even though the local farmers have always done so, heroically conquering even the steepest of slopes. It is with this spirit that the vocation for grape growing and winemaking has maintained and expanded itself in time, with an ever increasing number of companies, constant technological upgrading and the application of marketing strategies that have increased the quality of the product generation after generation, disseminating the awareness and appreciation of the product. Today, the Prosecco from this territory can be found in prestigious collections throughout the world and to its great credit, it is fully deserving of its fame. The Casalina Company of the Bortolin family is situated in a hilltop position with an excellent panoramic vantage point overlooking the hills around Valdobbiadene. The toponym indicates that in the past the manor house was probably a salt deposit. We are right in the heart of the Valdobbiadene DOCG appellation. The windows offer a great view of the straggling Prosecco Superiore vineyards and the white wine road. Being an enormous manor house, the sheer size makes it stand out from the surrounding landscape and makes it a natural stopover for the Eno tourists coming from all over the world who are welcomed in the new and luminous tasting hall overlooking the hills and rows of vines. Gaudium hospitis, the joy of the guest, is a Latin phrase that perfectly reflects the spirit of the company Casalina and is completely in tune with the principles of family tradition, hospitality. Inside the property, there is a palpable sense of the real and genuine, particularly in the warm welcome offered to the guests by the Bortolin family, who for generations have been producing Prosecco di Valdobbiadene in their own vineyards. Ulterior confirmation of the excellence of the company can be gleaned from the prestigious recognition given to Casalina by TripAdvisor, which features numerous favorable comments and write-ups by guests who have visited the area. The Casalina company look after every aspect of the production cycle, 
from nurturing and caring for the vineyards to the marketing and sale of their wines. The renowned Casalina sparkling wines are produced by means of a secondary fermentation cycle, the sparkling process, in special autoclave pressurized tanks using the Martinotti method. The control of the residual sugar and the yeast levels is the decisive factor in the diversification of the final product. The wine transformation period for this method is quite short and permits a certain production continuity with the sparkling process itself lasting about one month. In this way, Casalina managed to carry out up to 40 production cycles in one year. The wine is bottled straight away after having been stabilized and filtered without needing to undergo any other treatment which is, however, usually required in other methods. The winery is a true technological wonder that guarantees the wholesomeness and quality level of the product. The Casalina labelled sparkling wines therefore reserve for you the pleasure of tasting a top quality product which, when drunk in moderation, avoids any unwanted side effects such as headaches and acidity of the stomach. This wonderful area grow the Glera plants and with, from the Glera plants we have the Glera grape and with the Glera grape we make the steel Prosecco wine. We transform the Prosecco wine in slow sparkling wine or sparkling wine. Uh, the slow sparkling wine is uh, the lightest between, in our uh, production. Uh, we use the best wine to make the sparkling wine, the lightest to make the slow sparkling but a lot of people prefer the, the slow sparkling because it's so easy to drink. But the best quality is always on the sparkling wine. And we see the best quality in our bottle when you read on the label Valdobbiadene Prosecco Superiore DOCG. This wine, this bottle are warranted from the state with this label. When you read these words Valdobbiadene and Superiore DOCG, that means you have the best quality from this steep vineyard. If you don't drink Valdobbiadene, Conegliano and Superiore, uh, the wine is warranted too, but uh, is all the second quality from this steep vineyard or the first quality in the flat down. So to have always the best, you have to look for the name Valdobbiadene and Superior, Prosecco Superiore. We have other sparkling wine too, uh, this, uh, we have these two uh, rosé wine, both uh, rosé sparkling wine, both are made with the grapes Manzoni. Manzoni was a professor in the school of Conegliano who made new plants and uh, this wine comes from a red grape but we separate quickly the juice from the skin don't to have uh, too much uh, color, too much tannin, too much of the substance to make a red wine so heavy. And we present these two uh, uh, rosé uh, sparkling wine with two different residual sugar. We have a very sweet Manzoni Moscato Dolce, sweet, or a dry, extra dry um, Incrocio Manzoni. Um, you can drink this with uh, fish, with uh, um, ham, or this with uh, uh, dessert. 
and we have to a Moscato, very sweet too, with only 7 degrees alcohol and a lot of residual sugar. The innovative spirit of Casalina has always manifested itself without ever compromising the purity and natural state of the environment. A deep respect that is reflected in the fact that the winery itself is built inside the hillside in order to safeguard the beauty of the landscape. An outlook towards work and life that is shared naturally by Gregorio Botolin and his wife Neva, who manage the company together with their sons Massimo and Michele. <laughs>